Hello, my passionate simmers. It's Passions, and welcome to my new Let's Play The Sims 3 collection in Roaring Heights. Oh, wow. I'm so excited that I bought this um, new town. I, to be honest with you, I wasn't going to buy it just yet. I was planning on doing it like sometime next month after the holidays. But I just, I couldn't help myself. I saw the trailer and um, I was looking at um, some other LPs and and seeing them play around the town. And it was it's just such a beautiful gorgeous town and I was like I just couldn't help myself I could not just torture myself and just wait until next month to get a hold of this town I just couldn't so I had to get it yes I had to get it all right so I couldn't help myself in doing a new LP with it because once I buy a new world or I download a new world you know a custom new world whatever it is right away I just my head just starts going and my creative juices starts flowing and forget it and I just came up with a whole new storyline for this world that is perfect it is so so perfect I just I can't wait to tell you about the story I created for this world but before we begin let me read to you the little description that came with this town all right Welcome to a city where bold shapes, rich colors, and lavish looks rule the skyline. The residents of Roaring Heights are living in the fast lane in this booming place filled with striking skyscrapers and bustling beaches. Whether you're content to hang out on the piers, work your way to the top, or host glamorous parties at home, there's a place for every lifestyle in Roaring Heights with endless opportunities at your front door. Which new life will you choose in Roaring Heights? Awesome description. I'm loving the picture. So I can't wait to just dive myself into this world and just um, explore it, enjoy it. I'm just so excited. <laughs> I can't wait. And also I can't wait to tell you the story that I've came up with for this world. All right, guys. So I'll see you in a minute. I'm going to be talking to you about um, what this whole LP is going to be about. Now, I have called this LP collection in Roaring Heights because I am going to be using all of my stuff packs, all of my expansion packs, and everything that I've gotten from the Sims 3 store into this LP. I'm not just solely just going to be just playing with whatever came with this town. No, I'm going to be playing with a little bit of everything, basically. And um, aside from that note, I am going to be dedicating this LP to one of my most favorite beauty icons. Now, if you don't know who I'm talking about, by just hearing those two last words, then you have not lived. Um, <laughs> I am talking about Marilyn Monroe. Yes, a sexy, glamorous, beautiful, smart, blonde bombshell. I love Marilyn Monroe, Audrey Hepburn. Those are the most two beautiful women that um, I grew up learning about, hearing about, and watching. Yes, I'm only 32 years old, and they would have been now in my time in their 80s. But thanks to my grandmother, um, she was born around the same time that Marilyn and Audrey Hepburn were born in uh, the late 20s. So thanks to her stories and, and, and everything that she's lived during that time, around their time, she was able to tell me. And I grew up hearing about them and I learned to love everything they've done with their lives and their careers and everything that they were about. So... I decided once I saw the trailer for this um, uh, world, th the first thing that just clicked into my mind, the first picture I saw in my mind was Marilyn. Like I said, this is the perfect world that was made perfectly for the a story that I've been wanting to do, wanting to create a let's play using Marilyn, but I 
didn't know how to come up with it at first. But when I seen this world, it was just perfect. It was perfectly, perfectly made for her. Um, and I decided that this was the perfect world to create my little let's play, my little s short story about her and, you know, and stuff. So this LP is dedicated to her. Um, here you will meet my beautiful Marilyn Monroe Sim style. Now, she is not, nor I, I'm trying to make her look like Marilyn Monroe. Absolutely not. This is my version and my story of her. Yes, I took a little bit of her truth story and added a little bit of my own spice to it. You know, and so I'm excited to read to you guys the little short story that I created for her. And, um, and I really hope you guys like it and let me know, you know, leave comments, likes, and let me know what you guys think of this LP. Um, born in the late twenties in Los Angeles, her childhood was volatile. She passed from family members to family friends and frequently stayed in orphanages as a result of her mother's mental health. In the mid forties, she became a successful model and actress. 17 years under the spotlight, she decided it was time to retire and turn to the next chapter in her life and is ready to fall in love and have children of her own. Give them all the love and nurture she didn't get from her mother when she was a child. She wants to be there of every moment of their lives. She decided if she was going to start a new beginning, then she needed to move to a new town and she chose roaring heights was going to be her new home her new beginning love children and endless happiness will marilyn have all that she desires find out by watching this wonderful story as it unfolds in this let's play well guys what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to create my beauty icon and as soon as i'm done we'll be right back Okay guys, so here we are. I finally finished Marilyn and we are going to find her a home and alrighty, um, I'm going to tell you her um, lifetime wish, traits, favorites and, um, and stuff like that and also you are going to see a clip of or her wardrobes or her outfits basically and um this is going to be it for this part um we're definitely going to move her in into her new home and i'll give you like a little tour of her home and what it looks like and all that jazz but um this is going to be it for the first part um it's kind of like 10 30 at night um it's friday my kids are home and um they want me to go and watch some uh, movies with them and um and their daddy and stuff so <laughs> so I have to um, get this done with and over with and um, tomorrow I'll get back to filming part two of this awesome let's play that I'm so looking forward to playing it all right so let's get started um all right so she's given 16,500 and simoleons let's see what we have available here um, I haven't looked at none of the houses, so I don't know what they look like, so we are going to look at them together. Alright, so let's see. Stunning Starter, um, 50 Sunburst Street. I love the address already. Okay, Unfurnished is 15,058, and Furnished is 16,438 simoleons. So, wow. So we are going to be left broke if we choose this one. Um, let's take a gander. And let's just um, see what it looks like. All right. If only these. Oh, my God. This is a box. If only their graphics would come in. That would be lovely. Don't you think? Come on, graphics. Come in. Come on in. See, this is why I normally don't do this because because of that reason. All right. Loving the palm trees, but she is hidden 
in this behind the palm trees. You can really see it. Let me see if I can. Okay. I guess this will be a better angle. Wow, this is a little box. I don't like it. Not whatsoever. Alright, so let's get a little closer. Alright, she has a tiny little bathroom, which only fits a toilet. And the sink is over here. Now, uh, we're we planning on taking a shower. A bed and a dresser. And I think she has a little balcony back here and a balcony and a little terrace in the front so that means she has to I am not liking this house at all alright so her sh her tub is down here yeah no I'm like don't get me wrong I'm like it has potential we can get rid of these palm trees and and build on it of course but for a celebrity like uh, Marilyn I'm like hello so I normally don't like to cheat but since in my story she is a celebrity a retired celebrity you would think that she has you know money of course and she does so I'm thinking of probably doesn't matter like where I move her to because she is going to be in living in the lap of luxury like she's supposed to because she's a celebrity so I'm not quite sure if I want her to have to be rich right off the back um which she should be um let's see at this little houses let's see what they got to offer and um if I find something that is suitable for her then we'll just leave it like that and but if not, then we'll do a little mini cheat to get her in into something beautiful, something more nicer. And then just, con you know, and moving on from there. Most likely, I might do that. Just for the 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 sake of her back backstory. Just for the sake of it. Alright, let's see this one. Yeah, if she's planning on having a family, this is definitely very tiny. Which is all right for um our starting sim you know but she's not just a starting sim she's a celebrity she's marilyn monroe okay uh let's see what else uh we saw this one i think this is a little box yeah so let's take a look at this one all right um Excuse if you hear music or any voices or any type of noise in the background. That's just my kids in the living room listening to music on the TV. Uh, well, this one's cute, but still, it's very tiny. Mm. Oh my god, I feel a sneeze coming on. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Okay, um, alright, I'm, I like the little fancy thing, but, yeah, I know I'm being very picky about this, and normally I'm not, normally I'm not picky, but when it comes to her, it's a different story. This is a swift starter, alright. And she's right in the smack of everything, so... Alright, let's just get a different angle. Ah! Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Alright. Okay. Alright, what, what? Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see what this looks like. It's cute. Don't get me wrong. The houses are cute, but I don't seem to like anything about them. Like, I mean, suitable for her. Uh, did we... Which one? I think we saw this one. I don't even know. Did we see this one? 
Uh, affordable elegance. There we go. Did we see this one? I don't even know anymore. Uh, I think we did. Yeah. Alright, what's this one over here? Uh, the, f the frugal. No, she's not frugal. She's rich. Darn it. Uh, no, we saw that one. Uh, let's go over here. What's this one? Oh, and it has a beach view. So let's take a gander. Ooh. Oh, load up, load up. Okay. I'm loving this. I am loving this one. Oh, okay. This one is cute. Oh, but it's it's very cute compared to the other ones. This is adorable. Oh my god, this is so adorable. Mm, I'm so loving this. I and mean, I'm loving the colors and she has a, a beach view. I'm like, you know, this could be like, she's trying to get away from the hustle and bustle. From all the spotlight and everything. Like, they wouldn't expect her to be living in something like this. They'll probably expect her to be living in like something like this. Which, this is what she deserves to be living in in some of these houses. Alright. Lordy. Alright. So far, that is like the cutest one I've seen. And, and that's it. Uh, do we see this one? Oh no, I don't think we saw this one. Um. Yeah, I don't think we did. Alright, um. Alright, come on, load up. There we go, wait, let's go away. Okay, she's a cutie. Okay. She has kind of like a little more room to it. Oh my god, but look at this one over here with the pool. <sighs> Alright, um. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, um. I am going to give the girl some simoleons. Like, seriously, because these little houses, only i seen two. There are two you know they were cute but they're not you know it's not what I'm looking for her so I hate cheating I don't like cheating in my LPs but just this one time I'm going to give her some money just enough for her to get a beautiful comfortable home that it's going to suit who she is her personality remember she's a retired celebrity uh, yeah, she's been in the career for 17 years, and she's a young adult. Ha. <laughs> Anyways, so let me just do my little magic, and then I'll be right back, and then I'll show you the home that I've chosen for her. All right. Okay, guys, so um, we have moved in. I'm going to remove some of this money. Uh, I'm not going to make it that easy for her either. So I'm going to get rid of some of this money. But in the meantime, um, here is the home. Oh, freaking palm trees. They're adorable. They're cute. But they're in my way. All right. <laughs> Ooh, look at this luscious blue seawater. Okay. So this is a cute little home. It's very, it's like a minty beige, like, kind of like a beige minty type of color which in reality in, in real life when she was alive her favorite colors were uh, beige white black and red so that's why you see red in her outfit her favorite color red lipstick and stuff and of course uh, she wears Chanel number no. five all right so this is her beautiful home and um, let's just take a look at this I just love this part all right, let's take a look at her home. I haven't seen this, so we're going to see it together. So let's see what we chose. Um, 
Because I just moved her into empty lot, gave her money, and then I have her move from there. So I didn't, they only allow you to see the outside. You can't really see the inside. So we are going to see this together, and this will be awesome if things would load up. Okay. Alright, as we can see here, this seems to be kind of like the entertainment area where there's a foosball table and stuff here. Looks like a little mini bar area, like a little office over here. And this is kind of like a little library area, like a little, you know, um, and then she has the view. A little large uh, terrace or deck whatever you want to call it to a view of the ocean of course look at that she has a gorgeous view all right so let's go to the next level to be honest with you I'm not liking none of these colors but is going to stay that way um and then we'll decorate as we go as she has children Okay, it has is has plenty of room, so that is a plus. Um, you know. So what do you expect? Back in the days, that's how you know those were the colors, and that's how it was decorated, and stuff. So, um, all right, let's go to the next floor, and uh, let's see. We have a nice yellow sunburst kitchen beauty and then we have a nice little bluish um, dining area and then another little office over here and then a living room okay a little bar area another bathroom and let's go check out the back and here is a little terrace that takes you out to the back into her backyard looking into the ocean so so she is right in the middle of it she has a view of the bridge beautiful view of all the houses around her so this is gorgeous I am so loving this town is so beautiful I'm just so loving this all right, uh, let's see. Do we have another level? I don't think so. Yep, no. All right, so we need to get her a car, of course, because she's not going to be traveling in taxi. Does she have room for a little car? Does she? Uh, it looks like she doesn't. Uh, maybe over here. Let's see. Uh, possibly over here. So we'll see what we can do. Give her a little driveway for her little car and stuff oh these freaking palm trees i think i'm gonna move them i'm not sure we'll see what happens <laughs> all right guys so i'm going to end it here um let's let her walk in into her home and welcome herself into her beautiful home and i'm going to give you a little close-up look of um oh look she's already thinking about bottles and stuff i told you she's like she she wants to fall in love and she wants to have children that's what she wants so don't worry mama so we're gonna give you that real soon uh, my under um understanding is that there's a lot of hunks out here in roaring um heights so i can't wait until she meets her true love so this is a cute little outfit. I did not give her any of the outfits that came with the world because to be honest with you, I kind of didn't like them. The only one I did love and I am so in love with, it was the wedding dress. Like that is so, oh my God. And yes, I gave her the bathing suit, which you've seen in the little picture. I gave her the bathing suit, but you know, like I kind of didn't like the little dresses that they had there i liked it one which is the one with the skirt and a button down shirt but that's not marilyn monroe you know marilyn monroe was a very sexy woman and she loved to strut her stuff so um yeah she wasn't the type to be covering anything so if you know what i mean anyways 
Um, so this is her. I did my best. Like I said, I'm not a, a Sims creator, you know, um, and stuff. So this is the best that I can do from head. Um, like I have a picture of her staring at me. Uh, my favorite picture of all is the one where um, it's one of the clips of a movie that she did. Oh my god, I keep I forgot the name of the movie. But it's the most famous pic of all. It's the one with she's standing over like some type of vent area in the street and the wind hits from under her and pushes her dress up and she's all dressed in white. So it's one of her sexy beautiful poses and it's a very iconic pose. So that is my favorite picture of her and that is the one that I have staring at my face. So you can't really see her face too much because she's very happy and smiling and laughing so you can't really see her features that well so anyways so I try my best so this is what she looks like and I hope she is of your liking and if not oh well you know but this is Marilyn Monroe and I can't wait to get her to find her true love and um, become a mommy since is one of the things she most desires all right guys um let me before I let you go let me just tell you her lifetime wish of course is to be surrounded by family and is to raise five children from babies to teenagers I'm looking forward to that she's a young adult here her favorites are classical music lobster thermidor her favorite color is red in real life she was a Gemini but I love to give my sim my um, trait which is my I mean my sign which is cancer and um, her traits are family oriented irresistible hopeless romantic artistic and nurturing okay so that as you can see is her family tree and I cannot wait to fill it up all right guys and she's unemployed right now so we'll try to get her a job she's wanting to join the architecture design career I don't know. We'll see about how I feel about that. Alright, guys. So, once again, thank you for watching. And I'm sorry of the lack of videos. It's just that everything's been hectic with the move, getting the kids transferred to a new school, helping them get settled in, and all that. It's just been a hustle and bustle. But, um... I'm hoping to start bringing you guys more videos more often. Um, but now with Christmas and their school vacation around the corner, it's just very hard. But I will try my best to keep up with it and stuff. But thank you so much for being so patient and continuing to follow me. And I appreciate it so much. I love you guys so much. And once again, thank you for stopping by my channel and watching. I hope you like this video. And if you do, click on that like button. And please give um, leave me comments because I would love... I love to read them and I would love to know what you guys think um, of my LPs and of my characters and everything. And um, if you guys are, um, are not following me my other social sites, please follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr. I update periodically there about my LPs and what I'm doing um, with my life and all that. Once again, thanks for watching and happy simming.